My name is Ritz, and welcome to Dead by Daylight. We're doing a solo video today, because I just wanted to give you guys a uh, more like personal look. You guys seen a lot of multiplayer stuff, but we haven't really talked about this game much. So I figured we could do that today. If you guys just want to watch the multiplayer videos, great. If not, what else? But, uh, quick, like, rundown of stuff. Uh, each character has their own ability. So Claudette can self-heal once you get a certain perk at a certain rank. Uh, these guys, Jake Park, can destroy the hooks. Meg makes... Meg runs faster, so she can, like, save people better. And, uh, Dwight makes everyone, like, stronger together. Also, other questions I get asked all the time. Ooh, one more chest. Nice. Uh, I always get asked if uh, this game is on three, Xbox or whatever. It's PC only right now, as far as I know. I don't know if they're going to be doing more. Uh, and then uh, I play on it with a controller because the first time I play this game, my controller is plugged in, and I'm just so used to it now. I have like almost 100 hours of this game with the controller. <laughs> it's kind of embarrassing. I have that much time in this game, but I just really enjoy it. Um, and right now I'm trying to rank Claudette up to rank 15 so I can get a second perk. Uh, and then once I do that, I'll start probably ranking up Jake, because apparently it's easier to get blood points if you tear down all the hooks, which is actually not a bad, uh, not a bad way to do it. And then I also need, uh, to start ranking up my Wraith more, because I, I keep fighting against people as Wraith. I would do Wraith video right now, but I keep fighting against people who have four perks, and it's not fair and not fun, so. They push my shit in real hard. But, hell out. Reunite. No, we want the dude. You're about to get 150 points right here. Ready? Oh my god, I just want to get 150 points. Yeah, I guess we might have already gotten it. I don't know. So that guy for sure, like, knows that all he has to do is just keep destroying hooks and he gets points. Which honestly, I probably should have gone full first, but I thought self healing would be better because I always get in danger ultimately and then run around people like crazy so that's fun but uh yes uh they uh showed a picture or it's an art book for the game or something and the next killer is the crawler which is this female character that looks like the witch from left dead 2 and she's fucking crazy apparently uh and just uh they've apparently they said the gameplay is more vertical that's at least what someone in my chat told me last night and i don't know if that's necessarily true but what that does tell me is that if it is true, um, that'd be awesome, first of all. Uh, no. Uh, if it is true, though, that'll make gameplay very interesting, because I'd love to see, like, someone who's crawling on these walls or something and, like, hides that way. That would be super fucking cool. Uh, but so far, I think my favorite killer to play against is the Trapper, because usually have a better idea or a better way to get away from them i guess like the wraith goes invisible and can sneak up on you really easily the trapper you hear coming uh and the the hillbilly just could basically go fuck across the map in a straight line which i don't like at all i'm gonna try to get this one and then go back to that one maybe also i'm pretty sure i saw someone working on generator earlier oh that's a friend okay Oh, if he knows that I fucked it up. Oh no, he's just going hook to hook. Smart dude. It's so, like, maybe I would do more hook stuff. I'm just gonna just keep running with her. Because if I do hook stuff, I'm gonna keep going against guys like this who keep doing hook stuff as well. Uh, but I mean, it does make it very easy to win if all the hooks are gone and they only have basement left. So, I don't know. There's a lot of, like, metagame stuff in this that I think will be a lot more fun once we're in a full group of four. Like, you run with your, your friends, your four friends against a random killer. I think that would for sure make this game more fun. Also, I 100% doubt anyone's going to go save that guy. Which I feel bad about. But. I, uh. I don't want to risk it, man. Alright, I think he might be going for him. I've done a lot of, like. Single player y. Um. You know. Going for saving people and stuff. And in this kind of environment, it's so fucking hard. Because, oof, it's like that can happen. Oh, he died. It's really interesting to see when people die like that. I honestly think that they just seem to fuck up a bit. So I don't know if this guy's only been back towards me or not. I would hope not. Chocolos, or whatever your name is. I'm bad at names. I can't read, oh good, right? It's fine. 
Shit. Okay, well, he's gonna get distracted by this, at the very least. Also, it's also great for him to keep him the killer over in that area where the hooks are destroyed. Because the killer's gonna get fucked without hooks, you know? Uh, so, I played a practice game earlier today. I was kind of upset. I don't know if I'm gonna post it. It wasn't, wasn't that entertaining. But, uh,. I was able to, uh, I was able to escape, which is, you know, great, or whatever, but, uh, I maxed out my points, which is amazing. Maxed out on, oh, these points, rather. It's so funny how one person fucks up, and it ruins it for the other person, like, for sure. But also, you get more chances to do skill checks. Oh, wait, I want to open the door. Bitch, you're gonna go for it, aren't you? I'm gonna go around. Uh, no, she got it. That's fine. I'm gonna go for the other door. Although I'm sure other dudes are gonna go. Oh, we got hung down there? What the fuck? I don't see him on the map. Just pretty fucked. I'm gonna open the door and maybe save him. You got way more points. Well, you got 5,000 points for escaping. But also, getting door open. The other person's probably definitely gonna leave. I'll see him through your face. Hey, let's do that again. Got a real pretty empty head. Eyeballs giant. Alright. See the killer. see me. He for sure saw me. A goddamn wizard. Oh, well, rip. <laughs> now I don't give a fuck. Sorry, dude. I saved you. That's Jeej for you. Now, if the other friend went for him, that would be the ideal uh, situation. Is the other friend should go down, pick him up, and then they run away together. Whew. There's no way. He's going to get insta-hooked, unless he can find a place to hide as I let him away. Which I probably should have done more running around him to lead him away. But I got scared. <laughs> How bold do I need to be? Yeah. Nope, incident. All right. Well, that was good. That was fun. I'm just gonna leave now. I try. I tr I did try. I tried real hard and got kind of far. But in the end, it didn't really matter. But I got a lot of points. <laughs> That's at least twelve thousand. That's eight five. Uh, whatever that is. Oh, it wasn't eight. I guess I thought I thought it was eight, but I did get definitely fifteen though. Yeah, a lot of points. Well, uh, if you guys enjoyed this game, let me know. Oh, we were playing a really good one. So speed through defenses, six seconds. Oh, interesting. And twelve minor. Okay, well he was fucked from that. Uh, but yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and comment down below. As always, friend knows my name is Ritz. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. <laughs> <laughs> Let's play hooky. I'm hooked on fire. Ah! 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 Try to help me. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. How bad? It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. What's up? It's bad. It's bad. Where do you think you're going? Max. He's here.